Happy to have Abby Willis for NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson. With us tonight, two great basketball minds, Grant Hill and Steve Smith. Also, our reporter, Allie LaForce. And here's Gilgis Alexander. Jokic to screen. Gilgis Alexander feeling it out a bit. Outside, Brown. There's the drive. And Brown with the stuff. And the defense didn't even see Brown coming. Driving in hard and making a statement. Screen by James. And it's Gilgis Alexander on the drive. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. Hey, when in doubt? Run the defender off the screen. And you know, with a result like that, we'll see them run it again. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. Have to switch on that play. Back to Brown. Pass to Durant. The three. Sinks it from distance. Three points. The three-point stroke of Kevin Durant. Just timeless. And there's a whistle. That'll belong to Shea Gilgis Alexander. That's his first foul. First team foul. Gilgis Alexander with the ball. Screen by James. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. The desire to finish. Shea has that in his DNA. Here's Brown. First minute and a half of basketball played here in this one. And that one's good. Holmgren. And this is where Holmgren is such a scoring threat. His size can make interior shots easier to find. James, outside. This one for three. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. Grant, last season, Nikola Jokic came close to winning his third straight MVP. But in the end, he won something more precious, an NBA title. And that finals MVP award more meaningful, both personally and in terms of his legacy, being a winner is what matters in the end. Trading threes, you think you've got something going, then LeBron matches you at the other end. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. And good whistle there. That free throw good from Holmgren. So one for two that time at the strike. Yeah, many believe Holmgren must add muscle over time to his wiry frame. We'll see if he focuses on doing just that. James, outside. Stolen by Jokic. Jumps up. And the dunk by Jokic. Ooh, just great work cashing in on the fast break. Great job of reading the floor. Got to the rim and made a play. Screen by James. Takes a three. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. Shot from the top of the key. That's good on the jumper. And great awareness. 
Holmgren so good at reading the movement of his teammates, a very heady passer for a big man. Now here's Hill. James, outside. Three-pointer, no good. Yeah, you know, he usually makes you pay from that range. The open shot, Jokic. And that comes off the assist by Gilgis Alexander. Yeah, great pass to Jokic when he's ready to fire. And then he's straight into his motion. James, outside. And stolen by Jokic. When you say Kevin Durant, this game speaks for itself. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Jokic the screen. Pass to Brown. Shot clock at six. So it's the home team now. Trailing by 10. Ball with it. Now guarded by Holmgren. Kicks it out to Anadokounmpo. Down low. Can they get it? Oh, Giannis dunks it home. Clever ball movement by Klay Thompson. Getting the rock to a guy with a better look. Pass to Jokic. Thompson with a steal. Fast break. Here we go. Here's Worthy. And he jams it home with authority. And beat. Wall as a point guard, it's his responsibility to facilitate. Just a terrific dime right there. And you'd like to go two for one here, Grant. And at the same time, you want to get a good shot here, B.A. Back to Brown. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. That three's off the mark. To the paint. There's Shangoon. And Shangoon throw it down. This is who you want leading that play. A sure passer with great awareness. I mean, I'm just not sure what he was thinking right there. I mean, he needs to get his head in the game. Kevin Durant taking two shots. And both free throws good for Durant. We've seen him put a lot of pressure on the defense and then cash in at the line. To the middle. And Shane Goon throw it down. <laughs> boy, oh boy. Both teams lighting it up to start this game. And you wonder how long they can keep it going. At some point, you expect the defense will adjust. Miami team. Kevin Durant. And for those of you just tuning in, second quarter action is where we are. And what do you guys think about the visitors here in this one? Well, they've used the fast break well to score easy points and keep the defense unsettled. You know this, the team that dictates the pace typically rules the roost. We see that here early on. And Shane Goon throw it down. Great pass to set your man up with a high percentage look. Chandler. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. And he makes a first. Shooting for Miami. Tyson Chandler. He does not get the second one. Pass to Reeves. Outside Harden. Back to Reeves. Fires the three. Nails it from three. Reeves has gotten himself on the board with a three there. And remember, James Harden is usually a front runner in the league in assists. He has great vision. In transition, here they come. Pass to Malone. Here's Chandler. 
Here's Malone. On the wing, Harden. The three is up. Worthy. Knocked away. Here's Worthy. And here in the second with about a minute and a half gone by. Out to Thompson. Back to Anadokounmpo. To the inside. Tries the nine-footer. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. And the shooter had very little space on that attempt. And you know, we always talk about this. Just changing the shot can be just as effective as blocking it, even though it's less spectacular. Now here's Harden. No points so far. Pass to Chandler. And Worthy pulls it down. He is so good attacking the rim. It's rare to see him denied like that. Now here's Ana Kumpo. Off target from three-point range. Home team foul. James Worthy. Second personal foul. Second team foul. Here's Reeves. On the take. And he goes in for the dunk. Wow, that type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch, that's certainly a big time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. And here's the fast break. Oh, sweet oh my goodness. Just rising up to the rim. Man, when he gets up there, he gets up there. You know what I'm saying? A strong finish to cut into that lead a little. Man, left no doubt with that one, Grant. Harden from outside. James Harden. Gets his second attempt to go. Now he's one for two. And we know Harden possesses endless range, letting it all hang out right there. It's tipped. Hey, worthy, 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 worthy. Here's Chandler. Pass to Malone. Here's Chandler. On to Kumpo covering. Here's Reeves. Off target from outside. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Inside. Worthy. And a nice finish on the layup. Worthy's gotten his second bucket of the game. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Back to Harden. Pass to Reeves. Puts up a three. And that makes him three for four. He's looking good. And just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. The reason why they've stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. Six to shoot. Down low. Oh, a big finish. Now, B.A., you know they would love for him to get more of those opportunities. Well, that would cut into the deficit quickly if he does. And it's Miami's ball. They're on a 14-6 run. And there's the screen. Here's Harden. Driving inside. And then Harden with the jam. It is so difficult to guard Harden on the drive. Tremendous finishing at the hoop, but he's also elite at drawing fouls. Now here's Thompson. Still without a bucket. Kicks it out to Anadokounmpo. Count that bucket. His jump shots improve every season. Anadokounmpo's got a great rhythm on his quick release shots. Here's Malone. Whoa! He just got it off in time. That was close. Now, he doesn't panic in these situations. One eye on the rim, one eye on the shot clock, ending the quarter the right way. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. 
And James puts up a deep three. Off target with the three. Here we go. And the pick finished by Holmgren. There aren't many seven-footers who can attack guys off the dribble as well as Holmgren. He'll make you pay if you're too aggressive. Now here's Gilgis Alexander. Here's James. LeBron James with the flush. Hey, when in doubt, run the defender off the screen. And you know, with a result like that, we'll see them run it again. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. You have to switch on that play. First personal foul. First team. Gilgis Alexander, no good on the free throw. Line for one. The skills of SGA, they're so unique. His ball handling, shooting, length. Not a lot of guys like Shea in the league. Pass to Hill. And here's James. Screen by Robinson. LeBron without hesitation. And it's James with the jam. And in the history of the game, few players LeBron size have handled the ball as well as he does. Smitty, part of what makes LeBron James so inspiring is how competitive he is still. B.A., I don't think he'll ever lose that fire in his eyes. But you're right, he's still hungry. Every game, even the little ones, LeBron wants to win just as bad as ever. Brown can't hit. And they go to the intentional foul. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. Second team foul. Miami calls timeout. And your BXT. Ooh, it's stolen by Gilgis Alexander. Here we go, one on one. Pass to Jokic. Fires, top of the key. He squares up and sinks it. Jokic has got six. The defense gives Shea all their attention, and that leaves another guy open and ready to score. Here's Worthy. Good. Coming on the assist by Wall. They might be behind, but you can't blame him. He has been spectacular so far in this one. Gilgis Alexander up top. Puts up a deep three. And it's Holmgren missing. I know that he has the ability and confidence to sink that shot. <laughs> but better luck next time, maybe. You know what another option is? Just give the ball up. Let someone else make a play. Back to Wall. Stolen by Jokic. Here we go. One on one. The kick to Durant. Shane Goon with a steal. Here's Worthy. And with that one, the deficit trimmed to single digits. Worthy's got six points in the quarter. They've been aggressive during this run, but they've also played under control. And it has them in a great spot to take the lead. They love to get a few stops now at the other end. A short trip up for Holmgren, but there's plenty of power behind his jam. Here's Wall. And the big finish by Wall. This is anyone's game now, and they have the momentum. What I like during this run, they paid incredible attention to the details at both ends. That needs to continue. Now here's Wall. A screen by Kumpo. To the middle. A nice dish, and the layup goes down. And now just a five-point Miami lead. Assertive move. You can tell the game's heating up a bit. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. One-on-one. 
11 left in the third. Harden with it. Now guarded by Bryant. And it's Harden penetrating. Defense. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. Just an all-star level talent. I mean, stopping Harden from scoring is almost an impossible task at times. Now here's Wall to the paint. Screen by Kumpo. Kicks it out to Bryant. Five on the clock. And then Bryant with the dunk. Oh, I love this guy. Even when they're trailing, he works hard to put on a show. Hey, that might be just what they need right now. Now here's Harden. Give him eight. From deep three-point range. Hits a three-pointer. Three Harden's got 11 points. He's never shy to let it go from three-point range. Harden wants to make the D's job as tough as possible. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. To the inside. Ooh, it's stolen away. Pass to Chandler. 4-3 using his height and length there to prevent the second chance opportunity. And so it's Miami with a nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter. Their entire defense is designed to... And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth quarter. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Second personal foul. First team foul. Substitution on the court. Now here's Harden. They set the pick. Pass to Reeves. Back to Harden. Clock at six. Here's Reeves. Let's it go from deep. Gets the three ball to go. And Miami leads by 12. Everyone knows Harden is a talented passer. He can really rack up those assists. Down low. Here's Hill. And the shot's good. Talented, driven. He puts constant pressure on your defense. And it's Miami's ball. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Reeves. Austin Reeves. He drops it from range. Three. He's been so aggressive on offense. And with the results, you understand why. You know why? Success breeds confidence. And he's certainly been successful from there, time and time again. He's all alone. And he hammers it home to polish off the break. And despite the size mismatch, getting a little aggressive down there in the paint. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. The pull-up. Picked it out of midair. And here comes the break. Out to James. The rebound by Chandler. Here we go. One-on-one. -on -one. Harden, deep three-point land. Offensive rebound. Pass to Reeves. Shot clock at six. Here's Chandler. Checked by James. And it's Chandler missing. Hard to create space in that mid-range area. He would have been better passing that off. And they call an illegal screen here. Well, the league has put an emphasis to crack down on illegal screens. Yes, the last few years, the rules changes have tended to benefit the offenses. This evens things out a bit. Just under two and a half minutes gone by now in the final quarter. Pass to Reeves. The three hits the trifecta. Reeves is got 11 in the second half. 
They're really employing a deep range initiative here in the fourth, and it's working. Interesting approach coming down the stretch, looking to rack up points in chunks. You know, not the smartest play a defender can make there. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for Miami. It's just a passing clinic from them in this game. Solid communication and unselfish play all around. Yeah, the other thing they're doing is absolutely scorching the net. Red hot from outside all game long. You know, at this point, I think we can call LeBron James timeless. The seasons change, but his game stays strong. He's a rare talent. And that's out of bounds. Miami will keep it. The ball goes to Miami. Three-pointer, Harden. Ooh, coming through again. Shooting five for seven now. Gotta love how they've just maintained their intensity, even when they're this far up. They don't want to leave no chance for a comeback. Just focus on playing the right way. Hill for three. Sinks the trade. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answer each other from range. Cut X from downtown. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime. And they're doing a better job of creating space. An example of the unique leadership of Gilgis Alexander. Getting the three points right back for them. I'll tell you, at his size, once he gets it in there, it's over. Hill for three. Back to James. Outside, Hill. Clock at four. Launches it. Oh, my. Came close to a four-point play. He'll head to the line for three free throws. James Harden picks one up, and he's good on the first of three. And he's good on the second. And he makes all three. Now Gilgis Alexander. Fifty-one seconds left to play in the fourth. Just five to shoot. Tries it from the top of the key. Good on the jump shot. And Miami leads by 17. This is what winning is all about. Playing your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. Outside Durant. Pass to Jokic. To the wing, right side. Here's Holmgren. And the bucket counts. And he is on his way to the line. He'll try to make it a three-point play. Yeah, and the rookie is showing up. Holmgren forces his way through and gets the and-one opportunity. Outside Robinson. No one near him. And that comes off the assist by Gilgis Alexander. I'd like to see them run more plays for him. Maybe something in motion to make it harder for the defense to deny the ball. And so it's a victory for the road.